Welcome back guys to Splatoon where we have five more Zapfish and five more scrolls to find. The last level itself was pretty hard, you've got to say. I very much found that a challenge. So what's going to happen in the next coming levels? Well, our next level here is level 23, mission 23, which is the Spongy Observatory. Don't shrink, don't flinch. I'm not sure these tips and advice really help me. So don't shrink, which is, you know, kind of like something I don't intend to do, and don't flinch. Well, let's just be aggressive. But sponges! Watch, they don't suddenly shrink on you. Well, only that will happen if we get enemy attacks, surely, which means that'd be horrible. If you feel the sponge is full of ink, it should be easy peasy. It should be indeed. We shall hit that. We should be able to knock every sponge up quite nicely here. Right, onwards we go. Upwards we go. And to our first horrible looking zone, because could you bet there's an enemy here, plus all those sponges? Well, no one saw a thing. No one saw anything. I'm here. Jump on me. Especially because that means you don't jump on any sponges whatsoever. That's great and all right. So, the question is though... Scrolls we need to find. What's that down there? Okay, that's just a thing holding up the balloon. We don't have to worry about that. All right, there's something under us, which was very, very obvious. Uh oh. Um, I shoot a guy. Carefully does it. Yeah, carefully does it is really the key here. We're gonna have to take you out, aren't we, sir? You're not gonna let us, are you, sir? Aha! Supposedly that is Heidi enough. Hello! Right, so there's definitely an item under there, and if I had to be a betting man, I would say scrolls yet again, so let's knock that up. And then jump, I guess? Well, there's our scroll, but how do we get out of here? Oh, it's gonna be one perilous jump, is it? Okay. Perilous jump! Up we go. And over without an issue. We've already got our scroll, which is always good, because now we can focus on the puzzles on the actual level. Alright, spread the ink, and look how many people are in front of us ready to cause us misery and pain. And Ink Zuka, use it wisely. Well, I think I shall. Well, first of all, I'm going to take this guy out, because I'm probably going to be close enough. The other guys, though, however, probably aren't going to be far enough away that they can avoid me. So, we'll Ink Zuka. We'll Ink Zuka. Ink Zuka, go. Inkzuka, go. And I did not have enough. This is bad. Right, they're only firing single shooters, are they? Well, that's not too bad. We can make that. It was just... Oh, they shrunk my path behind me. I'm glad these things don't unshrink, that's for sure. A bit closer to hit these balloons, it seems. That one gave me the most. The gyroscopic aiming. It's the future, you know. Right then, up we go. Without much of an issue, I have to come past that crazy zone. Zuka worked for me quite nicely. Right, give me the goodies. Give me some armor. It's not bad at all. Blow up the sponges a bit. Though one of them didn't really blow up at all. Out of range ever so slightly, were we? Right, we're going to get bombs thrown on us, it seems. Sounds joyful, doesn't it? And I nearly swam off. There we go, made it over. Well, at least we're on solid ground right now, for the time being. Well, watch out for that one, yeah, you're telling me. Basically, I can come in its face, bombs incoming, come up to its face and smash it. Blow it up. Can't notice me in the ink. Well, I kind of need to make sure I don't go through the gap, if you can do that at all. Right, this is going to be horrible. Look at them. Now they're... Ah, oh, you knocked me down. That's not what I intended to do. Oh, it's not quite far enough. Right. If I can get further away... That's what I was intending. Right, that worked. However, this guy's being annoying, isn't he? Oh, you're going to get further away, are you? Oh. Well, it was a risk, but it paid off. 
Blow that up, make sure all the sponges are nicely formed. And keep getting up higher. Oh, okay, we might need to uh, ink a little bit there though first. I think I could have made it with that jump. I think I shouldn't have just kind of like ran out of it and went, I'm fine, oh, I can't make it, checkpoint here. Right, what's your step? You're telling me there's already like guys here. If you fill the sponges full of ink, it should be easy peasy. No, it shouldn't be because that guy is going to now drop a bomb right onto me. Yes. Cover myself my own ink. Restore my HP. I think that's how it works anyway. I think it heals you better if you do that. Whew. That could have been really bad if you look at it. That could have got me doom and doom. The way that bounced over. Right, we checkpointed. That's great and all, but we need to go down to a warp now? Well, the ink drips down naturally a little bit anyway when you squirt it, but a little bit closer maybe. There we go. That's a full path. Well, I actually just landed right on it. So that kind of worked out. Didn't really need it. Yippee, we found a zapfish. Indeed we did, but what problems are going to happen first? A couple of octolings, you say. Right, so what we'll do is we will up some sponges. That gives us some protection, some high ground, I'd say. Hide. Right, so nades are working out for me. We're going for high ground after all. This one seems a little bit more resistant. There we go, got you. Not bad at all, Agent Free, and we seem to have got ourselves a thing. I play so cautiously, and it works out in my favor. Bounce! And we'll take ourselves yet another Zapfish. Phew, Spongy Observatory is completed. So, to our next level. After we get our research note, of course, the traditional calamari shanty of the calamari region. Nowadays, this song and dance may as well be carved into the very DNA of all Inklings. It originated as a way to celebrate the sea and give thanks for its bounty. I saw on Splatoon Reddit, yes, there was a Splatoon Reddit, that someone had actually put this tune into like a computer program and just generated the tune so anyone could listen to what that was at any point in time. Maybe you guys can find it if you go look for it. But apart from that, we're moving on missions! 24 is our next one. Our next destination is way away as we reach the Pinwheel Power Plant. Slip through the defenses. That sounds horrible. Well, at least there's a lot more of a lovely looking day out. That's for sure, even though it seems the ground is above us. These spinny things are making me dizzy! Well, first of all, we always check behind ourselves when we go through some of that. Jump! Go under, jump! Right, so that's how it's gonna work out, is it? Well, first of all, there's a goodie this way. Is that gonna be a scroll already? Obvious goodie is obvious. Well, there's two warp points here. Well, we haven't even got all those balloons yet, so let's go get the balloons and then wonder why there's two warps. It'd be a bit worrying and wouldn't surprise me if one of them took us to a scroll and one of them took us the main path and then we couldn't get the scroll. Alright, so we got all those balloons at least. Which way to go first? Oh, really? 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 Okay then, we'll keep going onwards. I wasn't expecting that, so it swerved me quite... Well, spectacularly, really. Nothing there. Apart from enemies, of course. Did you see something go on there? Oh, you need to cover that up, do you? Okay, well. It's not going to work out so well for you, sir. Right, we got ourselves walkways galore, and probably enemies galore as well. You need... Okay, you're not going to run away from that, because of course you're armoured. You don't need to. I'll sort you out all the same. Is that an Inzuka? It is indeed. So, Mr. Guys. No one's going to go down now, are they? I can't get this one. There we go. 
That little bit of forcing you back is not so good sometimes. We're right, jumping over, and we'll find nothing else to get. Let's just keep covering the path. Hup. And up and over we go. Now, where are we going to? That's the question. That takes us... We could actually fall back down to the first area, more or less, from here. If we needed to. Always looking for secrets, though. Let's fall through that mesh. Nothing behind us. No hidden room or anything. Right, we've got ourselves a lovely, lovely, horrible place. Oh, I got hit. Oi, let me up. That's what I intended. Right, so we may as well jump on and then check the lay of the land, to be honest. Right, it doesn't seem to be really anything along this way. Nothing underneath either. So that gave us a little bit of a nice scope. There's an Ultra Trooper on the top of that pinwheel. There is indeed. That's annoying. And I missed. Ow! And I got hit. That's better, though. Right, what are you? You must be the scroll. There we go. We found it. Let's shoot that, shoot that. Shoot them. Realize that we've got to jump. And go with horrible camera angle. Right, there we go. Scroll is ours. And it launched us back to the platform we want to go on to continue forward. Blow it all down. Worry about what we're revealing behind it. Oh, we didn't get it. We should have got it by now. Well, I got behind you, sir. Did someone run off, by the way? I'm pretty sure I saw an enemy run off then. I'm not sure. Octocopter. Oh, my goodness. Right, we'll take that. We'll let them reveal themselves. And then we'll blow you sky high. For all you have done. Oh, whoa, whoa. Yes, that nearly did just happen. If anyone noticed, I nearly just blast myself off backwards. That wouldn't have been too clever. Well, checkpoint there. <laughs> it seems we're going down, is it? Let's just splatter everything a little bit. Nice and safe. And of course, take a ride because it's the easiest way to travel. Oh, hello. There's another one over there. And they seem to have a fair few inside them, so we'll look for claiming that as well. Is there one there then? No, that was just a TV screen. Well, there's something down there. Whoa! Momentum! Right, so we can fall down and get back up by the look of it. What we want to be doing, though, however, is... Probably making a big jump about now into that. Over, through, over... Through, on top, and up. Analyzed and defeated. Final checkpoint? You can bet it. Right, so here we go. Zapfish is found, but will I fall? Well, this looks horrendous. I'll take that hit because, well, I made it. What's going on here? Oh, hello. Um, I just managed to get onto that, which isn't so bad, I guess. Do I have to jump then while I'm in ink form? I do not know. Whoa! Nearly didn't make that one, though. Well, we made it over. Cool. The zap fish is up ahead here. That may be, but let's get rid of these. I don't think I can reach you. Stop shooting me! You keep making me have to dodge. I need to defeat you. There we go. Finally got you down. Well, you've kept coated some of the edge. It seems we're just jumping at the thing. Because of the way the jump is happening, we have to go low and then try to get up and eat through and... Actually, wait a second, I may as well stay this side. This is the side that's lifting, after all. Huh. And... claimed! Pinwheel Power Plant is defeated! So we have just three missions left now. Why are we here? For what purpose do we exist? We must not dwell on these questions. We can merely trust in the will of the universe and spend our days and nights in harmony with the world, celebrating this festival called life. 
Well, yet another research note claimed and read. And we've only got ourselves a few more zapfish to find. Nice going, nice going. Now, what's up next? Well, what's up next is the obvious. Mission 25. We'll get on to that next episode. Far-flung flutters is coming towards us. See you then. Bye-bye.